Well, Joanne and Jeff, certainly such a sad story. That attack happened right here along this dirt road, and it's just about 100 yards from where those dogs lived. Clear County 911, what is your emergency? Oh, I'm being attacked by a couple of dogs. They're on top what address? Give me an address. Hold on, hold on, I don't know the address. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That's the frantic call made by a woman who saw a horrifying attack Wednesday afternoon. Two bull mastiffs mauling a man who was jogging here along Thomas Road in Metamora Township. A neighbor fired his gun to get the dogs off the man. A bullet hit one of the dogs. Okay, where are the dogs? The dogs look like they ran off into some woods somewhere. The victim, 46 year old Craig Seitzma, who worked nearby at Eltro Services, was left severely wounded. Strangers were doing everything they could to help the father of three. Is anybody okay. helping the guy that's hurt? Yes. Yeah. Yes, there's a woman helping him. She's got like it looks like okay. paper towel. She's 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 leaning over him. But sadly, Seitzma's wounds were too severe and he didn't survive. The dogs were found nearby and have been quarantined. Police say the dog's owner told them he didn't know how they got loose and said the dogs don't normally act like that. Turns out police have dealt with the dog's owner in the past after two people were bitten by his dogs. We've had problems with dogs at this residence. If it's these two dogs, I'm pretty certain it was, but I can't come out on a guarantee and say so. The police chief also talked to the victim's three children who are understandably devastated and just want justice for their dad. It's compelling that he's a cancer survivor. Uh, colon cancer last year and, you know, he was just getting back, getting his strength back and, you know, he's exercising obviously and doing what he felt was the right thing for his mind and body and, and, and this happens. It really is such a sad story all the way around for the dog. Tell me right now it's not clear what action may have been taken against him in the past with regards to those two dog biting complaints to animal control. Meanwhile, right now investigators are really just trying to talk to neighbors and witnesses in Metamora Township, just trying to get as much information as they can and learn as much as they can about the dog's history. And then they'll pass that on to the prosecutor who will possibly present some criminal charges. We'll have to see what happens with that. But police chief tells me that the dog's owner has gotten a lawyer. Reporting live in Metamora Township, Anu Prakash, 7 Action News. Okay.